For this space drill, you need to find an area on court, possibly that the girls work in. So you might be in the goal circle, or you might be in the middle third, or you might just set out your own area of space. All the players start in the middle, and you give each player a number, depending on how many players you have in your team. The only rule is that before you can receive a pass, you have to go and touch a sideline. So they might go to one sideline and then be able to receive a pass in the middle, but they have to receive in the order of their numbers. You're encouraging your players to always be moving. So they're not just hovering to the side waiting for their turn. They're finding a sideline, finding a different sideline and constantly creating space until it's their turn to be in the middle and get the ball. To make this drill harder, you take away their numbers. So now it's up to them to read when the space is there for them to drive. You're still given the guidelines of being able to touch a sideline because by moving away from the space, we're actually creating space. So see if they can touch a sideline and then read when it's their turn to come into the middle. To extend this drill, we're going to now split the girls into two teams. So depending on how many players you have, you might have four attackers start in the middle in the square. They're going to be working the ball around with the same guidelines of being able to go out, touch a sideline before they can come in and receive a ball. Once they all receive a pass, you'll add in one defender. So it'll be four versus one. When they all receive another pass, add in a second defender, two verse four. And then you keep going until it becomes a four verse four situation in the square and see how long they can go before the defense get a turnover. As a coach, what you're trying to look for here is that even though we're adding in defending and we're all trying to get a pass, the players are still really conscious of doing a movement to create space. 